What about your social security if you commute between two EU countries? Are you planning to work in another EU country, or Iceland, Liechtenstein, Norway or Switzerland, and commute back every day or at least once a week to your country of residence? If you are, then what will happen to your social security coverage? Social security coverage includes, for example, your health care, your maternity or paternity, family and unemployment benefits, and your pension rights. Well, first you need to remember that only one country is responsible for your social security coverage at a time. And this is usually the one where you work and where you pay your contributions. Take Michael, for example. He's an engineer. He lives in Belgium but commutes daily to his workplace in the Netherlands. That means that the Netherlands, where he pays his contributions, is responsible for his social security coverage. Michael is therefore entitled to healthcare in the Netherlands. But he can also get access to full healthcare in Belgium, the country where he lives. To make this happen, Michael must ask the Dutch healthcare authority to provide him with an S1 form, which he can then use to register with the Belgian authorities. Behind the scenes, the Netherlands will reimburse Belgium for the health care provided on its behalf. But what happens if Michael should lose his job? Well, he will have to register with the Employment Service and claim unemployment benefit in his country of residence, in this case Belgium, and not in the country where he has been working and paying contributions. The Belgian Employment Services will then decide on his claim according to the Belgian rules, but taking into account the last salary Michael earned in the Netherlands, and if necessary, periods Michael has worked in any EU country, plus Iceland, Liechtenstein, Norway or Switzerland. He can get his working periods abroad certified in a U1 form. For example, for the last period worked in the Netherlands, he should ask the Dutch authorities to issue a U1 form. The good news too is that if Michael wants to look for a job in the Netherlands, he can also register with the Dutch employment office. However, he has to keep on reporting to the Belgian authorities, which are now responsible for his social security, including healthcare, family benefits, and, if he is eligible, his unemployment benefit. Thanks to EU social security coordination, you can move freely around Europe and not lose out on your social security rights. Social security coordination. Europe is your playground.